Look at you. You're so sweet. Lily, you're such a sweetie. Yeah. Oh. That's part of her problem. Is she thinks everybody's her new best friend. Oh. That's so sweet. Oh, look at that giant Sonic inflatable. I am going crazy. So much stuff. Say hi. Hello. I'm gonna make first best Zelda game. That is Twilight Princess, actually. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh. He's a Twilight Princess fanatic. And I will. That's case. Die, I will die hard for that. Oof. I, I wish we kept ours. Me too. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> So this is everything I got it to work. Now before I get into the haul, I just want to give a quick review on Torg. Torg was okay. I prefer Quarks simply because I found better deals, better steals. Here I found nothing. Also, I don't know if you noticed, but there was a booth full of fake plushes. It was all fake. That entire booth was bootlegs. I did not see anything like that at Quirks, and also I didn't see my yard sale booth like I did at Quirks. Like you know that Tails figure I found for three bucks, turn around and sold it for twenty. But here I couldn't find a single item to flip. But 
I still had fun. I met Jared from Retro Gaming Pandemic and got some good stuff. So I got Gulliver from Animal Crossing New Horizons. And I traded my Twisted Metal 2 game for this Harvest Moon Sheep. It's a promo plush, I think, from Harvest Moon DS or Magical Melody. And I got this flying Pikmin plush simply because it's really cute and I really wanted a Pikmin plush. And there was one booth. This was the best booth ever simply because of how cheap these items were. Now I did get basically market price on these but you don't have to factor in tax or shipping so I basically got a good deal. So I got Shadow the Tomb Raider flashlight that you got at GameStop for pre-ordering the game. These look like ordinary sunglasses, but if you look at the back, it says Pack is back, Pac-Man and Ghostly Adventures. Promise Sunglasses, got that for a dollar. Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity, Mystery, Guardian, Keychain. And ignore the noise downstairs. I got this for a dollar as well. Another Zelda Keychain, Phantom Hourglass. This is really cool. But got this for a dollar as well. Got this, I think, for three or five. It is a Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core disc holder. That's the Shinra logo. Another Final Fantasy VII item, just from the remake. You get this by pre not pre ordering, by getting the deluxe edition. My brother has this, but I decided to get it for myself. Got that for five. Got this for a dollar. They're Mega Man. 11 stickers. Feature Mega Man, Dr. Wily, and I forgot the dog's name, I'm sorry. And here we have a blow up balloon for Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't know if I showcased this in my Crash Bandicoot merch video, and I feel bad. So, that is the haul and my two cents worth on Torque. I do not think I will go back unless there is something big, you know, like huge, that happens there. And also the line there was very long, but complaints aside, it was okay, and I had a fine time. So yep, that's my haul. As you can see, got back from Torg, found Ray the Flying Squirrel. Same as always. I did not put this here. <laughs> this fucking walk starts just standing there menacingly. And got more of these. These were the last of them. I'm hoping that I get this Sonic, Sonic and Tails, and this Sonic right here, and then on the full set. Start with this one. All right, and we have Knuckles. Well, that's a duplicate. Next one. All right, this is happening. We got this Sonic. It's a rather iconic pose. Nice. All right, we got one of them. Number three. All right. We got the yes, two for two. Let's go. Number four. And we got another Knuckles. <laughs> That's two Knuckles. Number five. Now we got Metal Sonic. I mean, I already have Metal Sonic, but you know, it's whatever. Last one, I'm hoping it's the Sonic and Tails one. This is the one I've been really after, and I can't seem to get it. Open up truth. I got three 
knuckles. I'll try and fix this one, but this one's bent out of shape. Well, we got two that we wanted. I mean, it's fine. Placed our bets and we got two. And these guys, if you purchase any item, the first four people that purchase an item from an eBay store will get one of these for free. So, get your butts down in the description, click on the eBay link, and buy something! I'm desperate! Okay, jokes aside, I really appreciate you guys' support. You guys have been fantastic. Like, I'm blown away at everything that you've done. It's amazing. I know that every YouTuber has said that. But you know what? I'm gonna say it. You guys are amazing. I would not be able to do this if it weren't for you. So thank you all. God bless.